Make a planet without the bowl? Come on. Give me a hard one. Start with some fire red, like that. Nice. Top of that, some blue velvet. Right here. Grab some magazine paper and sprinkle it up. Swipe, swipe, swipe. Gorgeous. Taking my black spray paint, just gonna put my shadow on, like so. And then from there, I'll just circle my planet. Like that. I'll just fill in the rest of the board. Sticky! Just wanna be careful not to get too many stars on the planet. Little red space gas here and here. Make it worth a million. I'll even put a little shine on it for you. Right here. And boom, I can paint a circle. I'm fast as fuck, boy. Still fast as fuck, boy! Sticky! Make the planet as space, and space as the planet. If you're new here, you're not gonna know what the hell's going on right now. Stick around, it's worth it. Let's lay that black down, all over here. I want some gleaming pink space gas. Here, 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 and here. And some flash yellow space gas, right across here, and here. Sticky! Let's get a few stars on there. And a couple shooting stars too. Have one here, and here. Here and here, couldn't resist. In the same way, we're going to put some comets. One here and one here. I can already hear the haters. Oh, Tom, that's not a comet. Is now. Potatoes gonna potate. Now we get this guy back and put him down here. Now I want that gleaming pink here and here. And that flash yellow here and here. Now I'm going to cover the whole thing in gloss white. Scrubble this up, and then we use it to make our regular planet texture. Like that. A few moments later. I'll take some black and put haze around the edge. Why am I doing this? I have no idea. A little squiggly do, and boom. Oh, that is different, but I like it. A galaxy inside of an eye. Oh, that sounds really good. Let's. Bruh. You step into me, bro! Gleaming pink in the middle. The magenta on the outside of that. Cover that in gloss black. And a touch of white in the middle. I use the sponge to make the galaxy. Like this. Sticky! Get some stars on that. I just dusted magic white. Okay, a bit more mysterious. Just gotta dry this real quick. Cut the end out of a can lid. Shoot a little black in there, and we have a pupil. Grab this guy, put him down here. I'm gonna use this white to start making the basic shape of my eyes. So, like here, and across here. Just fill in the rest. Take this guy off. I'll take some black, shoot it across here, and here. Gleaming pink, all across here. And the magenta, here, 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 and here. And shooting away from the eye, I'm gonna cover all that in black. What's your star sign? Tell me in the comments. Lay this down here. Nice. If you guys ever get something stuck like this, you just need clear coat and a pair of tweezers. Just like that. Magic. Same for the other side. Bloody gorgeous! Now with this palette knife, I'm just going to outline the edge of this eye. One final finishing touch. Squiggly do. 
Yo, Atomic Dragon, do you see a galaxy inside of an eye right now? Huh? Huh? How about now? God, that is dope. This is how you make a portal to another dimension. Lazy Susan! We put a board right on top. Malachite. Spin A! Sky Blue. Spin A! Aqua. Spin A! Magazine paper. Fold it in half, and then in half again. Then fold it over so it's into the corner, like that. Keep doing that all the way across. You should have yourself a little ice cream cone. Now you just unfold it, and this is where the magic's gonna happen. Now I'm gonna take some white and spray it in the middle, and some black around the outside. I'm gonna take our piece of paper, lay it over the top. A little smoothie roux, peel it off. I'm gonna do one the other way too. Yeah, that is boss. Dab, dab, dabby roux. Let's get the white back, put a splash back in the middle. I'm gonna grab this guy, put him down here, and we cover the whole thing in black. Oh yeah. Sticky! Gonna need quite a few stars here. Back in with the malachite, and we'll curve it round here. And sky blue on the inside of that. The same for the other side. Now for a little white shine. Spin A! And boom! Yeah, nice! I wonder where that goes. An elephant painting? Oh yes! This is one you'll never forget. Hot lips. Mm. Press here. Some sunset orange here. And a little sunflower up here. Grab this guy, put him down here. Same colours, top down. Take this guy off. Now I want just a few little clouds. Down up here. Now on here, I want some black. And with some on the brush, I'm gonna start painting the horizon line. Let's get a little tree in there too. Okay, we have set the scene. Dib 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 on the sponge. Let's get some leaves on this tree. A little black just across the top. I'm going to fill out the rest of the bottom. Mama and baby, you can go down here. Now we grab Big Papa and put him down here. Now we're going to cover the whole thing in gravel grey. Now we add some crackle so it's like elephant skin. Now we activate. And boom! One happy little family. See Skyline with a lightning storm? I like the sound of that. I'm going to take some shock green and put it down here. And some acid green on top of that. A bit of fresh blue at the top. Now I want some black all over here. There's some aqua up here and here. I don't know why, but it feels right. Now I want some clouds just going up the side, like this. Now I want my first building to come right down the middle. Another one here, and another couple kind of like this. Now some black over here. Now the next layer. Now with some white, I want a flash up here. And with my shiny new palette knife, Get some lightning on the go. Make sure the antennas are being struck. Grab this guy, put him down right here. Now I want some black here and here. Some of that shot green here and here. Some of the acid green in the middle. A little dust of white too. Now we just tilt this guy down, give him a jiggle. Yup, it's marvellous. Some white mist up here. A little black just down the sides. I want a flash of white across here. Some shot green down here. And here, a little acid green too, and black, top of all of that. I'm gonna grab this magazine paper, and I wanna drag it, just like that. And the other side. Now using this palette knife, I just wanna put some highlights in the foreground. Carving out rocks and crevices. I'm gonna shade out the bottom with some black. Squiggly do, and boom. If you aren't following me yet, what are you even doing? What? A cave with a hole up to a shining moon. Sounds fun, let's give it a go. You can have the moon right there. Take some white and lay that in there. Place some black on top of that. Sea sponge, smash, smash. A shadow around here and a white highlight up here. Now, of course, we set it on fire. Grab this guy, put him down here. Now, I want some hazelnut brown all around here. Some sunflower yellow just on the inside of that. We cover it all in black. Take some of this flame blue, give it some of that. Sticky! A few little stars. Put a teeny little shine on this moon. Take this off. Using this palette knife, I'm gonna start carving out my cave. You can be as random as you like with this. Squiggly do, and boom, point of view, you're in a cave. Can I do a city on fire? Whew, that's a bit savage. I love it. Saffron yellow, all over here. And sunflower yellow on top of that. Sunset orange, same thing. Some hot lips on top of that. I'm going to cover all that in gloss black. 
I'll grab this magazine paper and make a little mold out of it. I've molded it into a kind of flame shape and I'm gonna use it to make some, yeah, fire, baby. I'm gonna take some black to just shade out this bottom half. Now we grab this little dude. Start putting these buildings in. Cross like that and down like that. Okay, that's done. Shade it out with some more black and then put in another layer. Making these next ones just a little smaller. One more layer of black. Grab this guy and put him down here. I want some black here and here. Some of that hot lips here, here. Sunset orange here and here. Some of that saffron down the middle. Teeny dust of white here. Will it blend though? That is the question. You're done, you're done. For those of you out there that say I never miss, you'll be pleased to hear that this is where it all went wrong. So I've done this piece twice now and both times I wanted to add a bridge and it's just not it guys. So I'm gonna leave it up to you, the people. Okay guys, so your choices are boom or skadoosh. Boom or skadoosh. Come on guys, help me out here. I can't decide which one I hate more. Malashite. Malashite. Yeah! Malashite. 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 Oh, you want my number? Here you go. <sighs> oh, God. Oh, Malashite. Malashite. Uh, don't you mean Malachi? Uh, no, I don't actually. I mean Malashite. Aww. This is a custom Valentine's Day painting for Toby. My man Toby. He's organized. Toby's girlfriend's called Ellie. Let's see if we can make something special for her. Let's take this piece of card, put a little black in there. Drip that inside of this circle here. And a little bit of white to go with it. Let's give it a squash with some magazine paper. Take it off. A little roof gray on top of that. And some white on top of that. Crumble this up, smooth it over here, take it off. Let's fade it out with some white until we've got ourselves a nice moon. Now I want a black shadow to go around here. Nice. Let's get the bowl down on it and we're gonna start an incredible night sky. I want some crocus. Right in the middle. Some flame blue up here. And here. Some ultramarine the sides of that. Some here too. I shade all that in with some black. See, I'm loving this already. Now you know it's love if you get any girlfriend that's sticky. I can already smell the comments. I feel like we need some more flame blue just around here. Get some shooting stars in here too. Nice. And a happy couple. Gotta set this off. Oh, she's a beauty. I want a few fluffy little clouds just swooping down here. Okay, skidoosh, squiggle diggle, and boom. Toby, Ellie's a lucky girl, and I hope she loves it. Peace. And then we will eat your face right off your head. Do you understand? So you want to see Venom? I am so gassed for this. Let's take my marble effect paint first and give ourselves a pretty cool background. It's all in the rest. Lick. I want to concentrate some of this in the middle. I think it looks like venom already. When I look at this stencil, it just reminds me of four hours and lots of stab wounds. This has so much potential to go wrong. Okay, let's grab the white. I'm so nervous about this. Okay, a bit more of venom's venom. Please be kind. This took a lot of work. Oh, yes! Boom! So sick. Challenge to make a tree without any paper. Come on, man. Is that what you've got? Silly boo fam. Got some hazelnut brown. So right here, 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 and here. Fresh blue up here. Himalaya blue here. Tropicana right here. A little sky blue down here. And some shot green across here. A little transparent yellow just down here. Now I want some clouds going right across here. Now I want my tree to go right up here, like that. Scraping through those layers, bring the brown out. Little highlight down this side. We want some branches coming off. It's not looking so hot now, but come on guys, trust thy process. Now on here, I want some smaragd green, some shot green, and some green apple. And you want to dib, dib, dib on the sponge so you're getting all three colors on there. And you can start adding your leaves. 
I'm going full on evergreen with this guy. You just fan them out so you get that dark to light kind of highlight. If you want to add some to the inside, just use your darker colors. I'm just going to load up some of the apple green. Dip, dip, dip. I'm going to randomly put some grass all over here. Squiggly do, and boom. One tree, no paper. Today, it's going to be this guy. Now the Punisher leaves carnage everywhere he goes. So let's start a fire. Some light yellow down here. Dark yellow. Shock orange. And some chili red. Cover all that in black. Take this and scrumple it up. Whoa. Yeah, that's fire, baby. Bloody! Oh, little wiggle. Yeah, that is savage. A few swipe marks down here, and some from up here. Let's get some more blood. I want a blood splat. Yeah! Let's make sure they know who paid a visit. And boom! Yeah, so badass. Punisher, hope I did you proud. What's this? It's an art project. Okay, I like it. Picasso. Yeah, that way. Oh, you want a fire planet? <laughs> now we're talking saffron yellow right down here. Shock yellow right on top of that. Little Campari orange on top of that. And some chili red on top of that. Now we cover the whole thing in black. We grab this magazine paper here and scrumple it up. And we put it down here and swipe, swipe, swipe. Oh yeah. Deb, deb, deb. Put a black shadow around here. No bowl this time, I want to keep some of that fire. Sticky! Didn't think we were going without the stars, did you? Sticky! Wheel! Some yellow stars, extra heat. A couple meteorites should finish this off nicely. Yeah, nice. Squiggle diggle. And boom! Yeah, boy, that is hot! An underwater city, yes. I'm in there like swimwear. Stop some malachite all over here. A little aqua, top of that. Now I want some gravel grey here, 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 and here. Magenta here and here. Shock orange here and here. Chili red down here. Sky blue right around here. I want some fresh blue at the top. Himalaya blue. Whoa, that's empty. Reload. Put that just up here. I've just decided I want blue velvet here, here, and here. Now I want some light blue across here. Signal blue here. Some ultramarine down the bottom. Grab some newspaper here and scrumple it up. I want some rocks coming through here and over here. Bring out all that lovely coral. And with this palette knife, just add in some highlights to the rocks. Very nice. Putting in some big ones in the foreground. On guard. I want the city to be right in the middle. Give it some of that and some of that. Because it's underwater, I want it to be, you know, quite faint. Just a little signal blue to fade it out. Just a few smaller buildings in front. Okay, here comes the tricky part. I want the whole city to be on like a floating rock. So that's the base. It's all gonna fizzle to like down here somewhere. Here's a question. Can you tell that I'm making this up as I go along? Let me answer that for you. Yes. Sea vegetables. Right, just gonna add a light source up here. Just sign it off right here. And boom, you know what? It turned out pretty sick. Great idea. The almost viral video, but completely changed the colors. Oof. It is on like Donkey Kong. Yeah, I think we had a planet up here. An ultramarine here, here, and here. And a little teen spirit up here. Black on this side. And some white around here. Scramble this up. I'll smooth that across there, take it off. I'll put a little black round here, and a white highlight round here. I'll pop this guy back down here. Now I want some acid green all up here. And some Tropicana here, 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 and here. Now we cover the whole thing in black. Back in with the acid green up here. And the Tropicana up here. Sticky! Let's flip the stars on. On guard. Now we go across like that, and down like that. Fade it out with some black. Put some smaller ones down here, and that's done. Grab this guy, put him down here. I want some black here and here. Some of the smaragd green here and here. Tropicana here and here. 
and some white here. Will it blend though? That is a big question today. Back in with the white, got a nice misty waterline up here. Okay, you're done. Every city needs a bridge, right? And let's put in the road. I didn't actually know what these were called before, but now I know they're called suspension cables, thanks to you guys. I think when you last saw me doing this, I was calling these liney things. Okay, squiggle diggle. And boom, yeah, nice. Question is though, does it beat the original? Oh my God! Put sticky on that thing at the top. Yes, I love that idea. Let's kick this off with a black base coat. Okay, now we need to make the stencil. To the back cave. Let's take this guy out of here. Now the stencil's complete, we just lay it down on here. It's gonna weigh it down with some stuff, just in case. You know the drill. Sticky! My plan is to make the word out of the actual sticky. Not sure why it's gonna be enough, so sticky montage, come on. Sticky! 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 My rubber split. Sticky! 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 I think that should do it because my neighbors think I'm officially nuts and my finger cannot take any more. Okay, let's hang her up and see the result. And boom, yeah, I am in love. Wait, I'm not done. And boom, yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Sticky! I make a malachite planet. Thought you'd never ask. Let's get the malachite down here and some for my signature. Put some black on this side, some white on this side. Let's grab the old little weekly and scrumple him up. Swipe, swipe, swipe. Yes. Dabarino here and one here. Put some more black on this side to create a shadow. And let's get the bowl on it down here. Now we cover it all in black. Sticky Malachite. Said no one ever. I am loving the Malachite stars. Should use these more often. Always. Use protection. Little Malachite shine to finish it off. Squiggly do. And boom. Oh, Malachite is in the house. That's freaking sick, man. Pick that winner. I can't believe what happened with this giveaway. Seb sucks at art. <laughs> Love it. So yeah, remember that. So I was just about to ship this prize off in the mail and I thought, you know what? I'm gonna give it to him myself. This is gonna cost me a couple hours in the car and they have no idea I'm coming. So I hope they're in. Sorry. Hi. Hi. This so it's at this point I realized that Seb is probably a young lad. This is his mum and she has no idea who I am. I'm bricking it. It's Seb in. Oh no, we good, we good. Sigh of relief. Hello. <laughs> no way I can deliver it personally. Hey Seb. How's it going mate, you all right? Seb, how do you feel about your prize? Very good, <laughs> very, very good. Look at this masterpiece in the palm of my hand. Thank you very much. I'm glad you like it, man. Follow, get him to five, <laughs> get him to half a million. Hey. That's pretty good. A mountain with a planet above it, any colour, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Let's go. This planet is going to be a big boy. Bavaria blue down here. Little aqua here. Tropicana up here. Now I want some black down here. And white up here. I'm going to grab the newspaper and get it scrumbled. Give it a smooth over our planet. Take it off. Now I want some more black down here. And with the white, I want a shot of it here, and then some around here. Let's get the bowl back on it, right down here. Now some black for the sky. And the Tropicana around the bottom. And some white too. Sticky! A few little stars here. Take this guy off. Okay, we are winning so far. Now for some clouds, just across here. Like that. Now on here, and some black. Now I've taken this shaped piece of card, and I'm going to dip, dip, dip. I'm just going to start with some... Really distant mountains. I'm not ruining this, I promise. Now with some magic white, I'm just gonna put some mist to the front of these. Now with some black on the brush, I want a big peak going right up the middle. Okay, let's get that filled in. I have another guy right here, and one here too. Now on here, there's some aqua. Another piece of card, dip, dip, dip. This aqua is gonna make up the dark side of our mountains. Tropicana. Just using that Tropicana for the light side. Now we want some white for the highlights. Dip, dip, dip. Blend it in with the other colours, which is exactly what I want. Let's get some more black on the brush. A few flicky roos here to make a tree line. Grab this guy. Gonna put him right there. Okay, put some black at the side. Some aqua right here. Some tropicana right here. Some white across here. Jiggle, jiggle, jiggle. Put some white mist at the top here. 
and I'm shaking the sides. You're done, you're done. And boom, yeah, I am in love with this. That is magic. A challenge to do a cosmic penguin. Yes, my friends, you know me. I have some planets here, here, and here. Let's outline those guys. Ultramarine down here. Some Himalaya, top of that. Little weekly, scrumpy scrumpy. Couple of swipes on there, take it off. Little aqua here, little white. Give it a high five and swoosh. Some light blue here, some black. Paper and smash. Give this guy a white highlight. A black shadow here. And a teeny one for this guy. No bowls today, it's all about those paint caps. Touch of aqua down here. And we cover everything in black. Just being careful not to blow the caps away. Now for the stars, we need some of that sticky. Just flick those guys on. Let's go for some Orion's belt vibes. Yeah. Flame blue going right up the middle. Like that. It's a magic white, it's either side of that. Let's take this guy off. Oh, beauty. Now using my super high-tech skadoosha, we're just gonna Skadoosh. Pingu, motherfucker. Now with this light blue, it's gonna fill in some of these gaps around the edges. And some ultramarine up the middle. Now I'm gonna hit it with the crackle. Now we activate. Squiggle diggle. And boom. Oh yeah, that is one cosmic looking penguin. Yo! A cherry blossom tree with a fallen samurai. Let's we'll start with some chili red right in the middle. Grab a lid and put it down here. Grab this guy. Now some chili red and white. I'm going to use this to make the Japanese rising sun. Put a white shine around this guy. Take him off. Nice. Grab this guy. Put him right here. Just decided I want some transparent red right around here. Back in with the chili red here. Some royal red over that, and some black over the top of all that. Now with some white, just gonna shoot some mist at the top. And you're done. Grab your Tesco vouchers and scrumple them up. I'm just gonna drag it to create some texture here. Same for the other side. Now with some white, just gonna shoot some mist across here so I can add another layer. Draggy, draggy. Just using this palette knife here to add some extra detail. A few little scrapes and you got a whole new world. Another layer of white mist across here. Now on here, I want some black. Now with some on the brush, I'm gonna start putting in the cherry blossom tree. My trees usually look terrible until the end, so bear with me. It's gonna give the trunk a little highlight down one side. Now on here, I want some power pink and some white too. Now I've torn up this paper towel, I'm just gonna soak some of that in there, like that. Now as we add our blossom here, they'll blend together. Beautiful. Sticky. Cherry blossom likes to fall off, so let's flick some about. Sticky. A few white bits too. I wasn't actually sure if that was gonna work out, but it's come out pretty cool. Now I want some black for the foreground, just down here. A few blades of grass, cause why not? Now I've made up this stencil for the fallen samurai. Just some final mist down here. A little more cherry blossom. Signed, sealed, delivered. And boom. I've got to admit guys, I am a little bit in love with this. A planet for the Ukraine? Yeah, go get them boys. Okay, let's put this guy down here. Sunflower yellow on this side. Bavaria blue on this side. I want this side covered in black. And this side covered in white. Grab the old pick of the week and scrumple them up. I'm gonna lay it down over my planet here and swipe, swipe, swipe. Yeah, it's looking dope. Shadow. Yellow and blue for the squiggle. We get the old cereal bowl and put them down here. Now we cover the whole thing in black. Sticky! A few yellow stars, some blue shooting stars. A white shine to top it off. I hope plenty of Ukrainians get to see this. We're rooting for you. And boom.